Under the sponsorship of the Consulate General of the Republic of Malta, Dr. Raymond Sherry, Consul General in Canada, sponsored a historic exhibition called The Heritage of Postage Stamps in Malta, marking the 56th anniversary of Malta's independence. The exhibition was held in the Depiro Hall of St. Paul the Apostle Church in the Maltese Junction. Once the attendees received their gift of traditional Maltese goodies, the exhibit was officially opened by Dr. Sherry and Father Mario Mikalev, parish priest of St. Paul the Apostle Church. The exhibition commencing its North American tour here in Toronto consisted of many Maltese Canadian visitors as well as members from the Many Stamp Collection Club in Toronto and the exhibit was accessible for the public for a week. The exhibition featured a history of postage stamps that covered a period from 1592 to 1963. The earliest known letter from the period of the Knights is that from the Grand Master Liesel Adam to the Bishop of Auxerre and it's dated at June 14, 1532. During his short stay during the French occupation of Malta, Napoleon focused his attention to the financial aspect of the postal services and contemplated the reorganization of the post in a way to cover expenses by charging for postal matter. Roger Duke was given the title of Imperial Postmaster and assuming the superintendence of the island post office and in 1985 was appointed postmaster under new law for a period of a year. The UK postage stamps were no longer valid for payment of postage in correspondence posted in Malta and in Gozo. In 1889, Malta issued the first set of pictorial stamps, thus moving on from depicting monarchs' heads on the stamps. In 1919, two decades after its original issue, the 10 shilling black stamp depicting St. Paul's shipwreck was reissued due to a publishing oversight in, the, in first of all dep depleting the stock of original stamp and compounding the problem by issuing a limited amount of the new stamp version, re which resulted in a shortage of the new version, making it highly sought after by collectors and considered as Malta's rarest and most expensive stamp in the Malta collection. Over a 23-year period, artist Emvin Cremona designed some of the most noteworthy Maltese stamps covering historical events, renowned Maltese and, for and foreign personalities, uh, purely abstract forms, and 16 Christmas sets comprised of 62 stamps. The event was made possible thanks to funding provided by the Ministry for Foreign and European Affairs, Malta Post, and the Malta Postal Museum. A final big thank you from the Consulate General goes to the many Maltese Canadian volunteers who gave their very best to make this event possible.